you can hear how much noise make this fan. So we're gonna fix that. All fans have sticker and under that sticker there is a bearing that must be lubricated. With syringe filled with lube oil we're gonna lubricate the fan without getting out from power supply. The operation was successful and the fan worked like new. We continue making projects from old DVD drive and this time we are making electricity generator and this small motor with few gears can deliver enough power. On that motor I am soldering bridge rectifier and you can hook up a LED. With digital multimeter we measure about 3 volts. Just to see if it works I solder a DC DC booster, plug the USB cable and we get enough power to charge a older phone. This was a cool experiment and show you how you can make a generator from DVD drive parts. Ok, you will need to buy a ultrasonic mist maker or fogger maker for water fountain. I must mention that this device is working on 24 volts AC. In this plastic container we gonna make big hole for exhaust pipe and on lid of container we gonna place it DC fan that you can easily pull out from any old computer. Also, the water must be with room temperature or above so mist maker can work. I have tried it with cold tap water and it doesn't work at all. Now place the device into the container and plug the AC adapter that gives 24 volts. As you can see, the simple fog machine or fogger maker is working. I am using two power supplies, 24 volts for mist maker and 5 volts for blower fan. I really like it, this project so don't forget to support me by hitting that like button below video. First of all, you will need to buy this self-adhesive sun protection window film with mirror effect. You can find in car shops. I have cut piece that fits to my glass that I found home. Next step is to spray the glass with liquid soap. The window film is double layer and it's self adhesive so we can directly put on glass. With this plastic piece that came in package with sun protector we gonna remove the bubbles that are between glass and protection film. Like so. Wait about one hour to dry out. Also you will need ordinary mirror with same size like glass mirror that we done before. On each side we gonna glue cardboard pieces like I show you now and you should get something like this. This is LED blue strip that work on 12 volts. 
put the wire through the cardboard and self adhesive LED strip we gonna glue inside. Once again put some glue with glue gun on top of cardboard pieces and place the double effect mirror that we made before. Connect the LED strip to power adapter that give 12 volts and here For refill empty lighter you will need, of course, a dead lighter, one push pin and button gas. First step is to open the valve at bottom of the lighter and you can do this by pushing the tiny BB inside the cartridge with push pin. After doing this take your button gas and put it over the hole and hold it about 5 seconds. Then quickly place your thumb over the hole and with push pin close the hole. And that's it, how to refill an empty lighter. Black box that have speakers with MP3 player. Magnet holder for screws, LED light when you need it and after hard work open your cold beer. You can also charge any USB device. Ok Hacktubers, today we are gonna upgrade this toolbox into a hack box. You will need stuff that work on USB power, like these USB speakers, short USB extension cable, strong magnet, mp3 player with radio, bottle opener handmade, USB LED light, power bank, 4 port USB hub, 5 volt solar panel and of course you will need toolbox. I have made holes for speakers, MP3 player, phone charger, LED light and for bottle opener. All gadgets I have attached with glue gun. This is the fastest and simplest way to bond objects to something. Now I'm gluing the USB cable for charging the phone and turn out pretty good. Next is to attach the magnet and gluing the LED light. The bottle opener is fixed with two bolts. On top of box we add the solar panel that will charge the power bank. From here one USB cable is for front USB outlet and on second USB output we plug the USB hub warmer. On USB hub we gonna plug the speakers, MP3 player and LED light. And almost forget the 3.5 jack from speakers plug into the MP3 player. We are finished. I hope you like this project. With clicking like, you help me a lot.